Hi, in this session we will see how to test TCP IP connections by using the ping command. So to test TCP IP connectivity by using the ping command, use the display of IP config command to ensure that your network adapter is not in media disconnected state. So let us open command prompt and then issue this command. To open command prompt, go click start, go to all programs, accessories and click command prompt. Go to the root directory and then issue the command ip config and hit enter. You can see that IP address of a machine is 10.0.0.12 and the default gateway for my machine is 10.0.0.1. So now let us ping the default gateway and see if we are able to reach it. To ping the gateway, write command ping 10.0.0.1. And then hit enter. If you get reply from the IP address you're trying to ping, then you are surely able to reach it. You can also have a look at ping statistics for 10.0.0.1, wherein you have sent five four packets and you have also received four packets. There was absolutely zero percent loss in reaching this default gateway. There could be a possibility that your machine is not hooked on the network. In such cases, your media adapter will show as media disconnected in here. Let me unhook this machine from the network. I just removed the machine from the network. I got a pop-up over here that my network cable is unplugged. Now let me issue the same command. IP config. See now it says that media is disconnected. Let me put it on the network. The machine is on and trying to see. Now it is connected to my local area network. Let me give the command again. And I can see it is onto the network. Now let me try pinging Google from this machine. So to ping Google, I'll issue command ping www.google.com and I'll hit enter. I can see that probably it is trying pinging Google but not able to reach. We'll give some more time for the machine to try reach Google. See, it has given up and it has not been able to reach Google. What could be the reason for that? Let us go into the network properties of this machine. To go to network properties, click start, go to control panel, open network and internet connections, and then click network connections. You will see the local area connection, right click it, go to its properties, highlight internet protocol, TCP IP and click properties. You can see that there is a DNS server given in over here, 10.0.0.10. So whenever you try ping say google.com this DNS server in here will try to resolve this name to the IP address and then forward all your data packets to that IP address. I suspect that this DNS server is not reachable from this machine. Let us try pinging this DNS server. I'll say ping 10.0.0.10 I'll hit enter. See, I am correct probably. If it says request timeout, which means I am not able to reach this DNS server. 
So what do I do now? I need to give an alternate DNS server which is probably up and running on my network. I know there is another one and I'll key in 10.0.0.1 which is another DNS server on my network. I'll say OK, say close. I can also go and see the settings from ipconfig slash all and it will tell me that okay my IP address is this and in DNS servers I have now two DNS servers in here I'm successfully able to ping 10.0.0.1 so now let us try to ping Google back again and see what happens see the alternate DNS address is able to translate these names into the IP address of Google. So this is the IP address of Google 74.125.236.84 and my data packet from these mach this machine is able to go and ping Google. So it is very important even if your machine is on network and you're trying reaching some website and you're not able to reach the reason could be the DNS server in between might not be accessible. You should be having the right configuration of DNS server. To test that, go ping the DNS servers which are listed in your ipconfig slash r and see if your machine is able to reach them. That's pretty much it. In this session, you are now successfully able to know how to ping a machine and how to check if correct name resolution is happening if not you can go and specify the DNS servers which are up and running and reachable from your machine thanks for watching